looks change my mind like that please don't take this what's good gang so i'm back today with the aries read um if you guys are new to my channel thank you for coming through and supporting make sure you subscribe like and comment um also i've just been working on the fire signs today so we're gonna go ahead and get into the main idea of the spread right now so spirit i ask that you oh they, they gave you two okay all right spirit <laughs> yeah you too spirit said you need two look at the bigger picture it's time to release negativity look at the bigger picture and it's time to release negativity yeah it's time to let go of what was not serving you let it go let it go forgive And let it go so it's a full moon in scorpio if you've been feeling paranoid and acting weird take this card as a very direct message from the cosmos to stop it worrying yourself is pointless and to be honest just to let y'all know this is the only read that i've pulled for and two of these cards have came out okay um if someone has been unkind to you has been unkind to you perhaps it's time for you to release them this card heralds an emotion intense time for both the full moon and the scorpio themselves are both extremely intense it's time for you to feel all of your feelings there could be some nastiness in the air when you pull this card if that's the case Take it as a sign to move away from anyone or anything you feel is toxic. For some, however, this card has totally a different meaning. Your sex life can improve if you make an effort. Use your magic. You have all you need inside you to bring about the desired results. Emote. It's all better out than in. It's time to move from living fearfully to living joyfully. Your right to have your suspicions. Grudges are toxic. Let something go. The end of an argument. Baby, let it go. It ain't worth it, okay? It really ain't. Um, anything that is not serving you, let it go. Forgive and move on so that you can grow. Look at the bigger picture. Full moon and Sagittarius. I just did Sagittarius read a little bit ago. Maybe you guys need to go watch it. Um... Uh, yeah maybe y'all need to go watch it because in the, in the um sagittarius read i talked about how um someone was allowing negativity to stop them from um continuing what they were doing in life like they were allowing it to get them defeated like allowing the negativity from outside people to get to them when Technically, they're supposed to be allowing it to motivate them. So, yeah, go watch it. How about that? So, are you thinking too much about the details of your dilemma? Fretting over the meaning can be counterproductive. Or perhaps you're being all talk and no action. This card is a reminder that while it's good to think things through, and sometimes you need to step back and look at the bigger picture, what do you then see about your current situation? What's the most positive thoughts you can have about it now it is time to count your blessings even if you don't yet have exactly what you want this card is also a reminder that we often have to take a few risks and go with uncertainty on this journey and called life try to keep an open mind about what's for the best the universe could surprise you take time out of your minute mini break in adventure this situation may have come around because you've been distracted be confident without being overconfident to win the day have you shown that you care if not now it's time find balance between speaking your mind and saying too much so yeah look at the bigger picture let's see what spirit says for you today spirit i ask that you give me cards for aries two cards for aries okay hold up so boom, we got page of swords. Caring about what other people think. Mm -mm. Caring about what other people think, which is putting you what 
Let's see. Um, insecure. Insecure. Don't allow your insecurities to get in the way of Yeah, don't allow insecurities to get in the way, babe. Let's see, anything else? No, wait. Anything else, spirit? The Aries need to know? Let's see. Yeah, you're not happy with where you are right now in life. Let's see. Um, ooh, mm. Because you don't know, um, basically, you're feeling insecure about your situation. Because one, it's like you're not taking action. You're in your head. You're not taking action. So it's like you're not satisfied with where you are. But it's like you're not realizing that you're the only one that can um, face your insecurities and improve your self-confidence and... It's all in the masses. Like, you got to understand that what you think is what you are. Like, what you think is what's going to come to your reality. Yeah. Let's see. Anything Aries else Aries needs to know? Anything else? Okay, let's see. Ace of Cups. Challenge. Emperor and Upright. Fortunate setbacks. So these things are holding you back. Your insecurities, your low confidence, your... All these things are holding you back. Being in your feelings, being in your emotions. Um, so you need to be honest and truthful with yourself on why you're not um, progressing. You need to, yeah, you need to be honest with yourself. Are you doing enough to get out of your situation or are you just sitting and soaking like that? Like, dude, not really wanting to make a decision on your next move. Yeah. You're holding everything in. You're not really talking to anyone about what's going on with you. Um, you're sulking, you're you're sad, depressed because it's like you're not getting what you want because you're not taking action. How that work? Aries. You better get up off your boo ha <laughs> Your boo ha What? You better get off your booty ha I mean, <laughs> you mean to say that? Y'all better get off y'all butt and do something. Take action. You can't just be all talk. You can't just be saying, hey, I'm going to do this, 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 and this, and don't do it. Like, your actions got to match your words. Your actions got to match your words. And if it ain't matching your words, then obviously you're going to you gonna feel some kind of way because it's like, yo, I told this person, that person, the internet, this, that, and third, and it ain't happening for me. So, it's like, I don't know what to do, you know? You need to take action. That's what you need to do. Take action. What is wrong with you, Aries? Let's see. Anything else Aries needs to know? 
Yeah, go on. Maybe you need to go home and moan and, and, and think about some things. And then, yeah. You gotta come, come, whoo, come up with some ideas or some, or some. Talk to yourself. See what's going on. Uh, yeah. What you need to let go of in order to move forward. Because whatever it is that you hold it in or hold it back, it's stopping you from um, taking action on your dreams. Anything else ever you need to know? Anything else ever you need to know? And can't nobody fix it but you, Aries. Let's see. Eight. Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. So you might need to try to concentrate a little bit on what those action steps is going to be. What those action steps are going to be. Let's see. Anything else Aries needs to know, Spirit? Let's see. You're, to, you're going like you're not doing enough. You're not doing enough to get the success that you want. Or need. Yeah. Anything else Aries needs to know, Spirit? So you're disappointed, you upset, you mad at everybody else, angry at everybody else. Um and then and these people don't really wanna be people don't even really wanna be around you because of the energy that you're in. Or it's it's the other way around. You don't wanna be around other people because Yeah, you need to go, um, yeah, you need to go sit and sit somewhere all alone by yourself so you can think and process, see what you're doing wrong, see what you're not doing, write it down, think about what you can do to help the greater good. Um, see what you need to let go of so that you can um, get your stuff together so that you can take action anything else Aries needs to know spirit Empress and once you do that you can let's see Painful, deep, and trouble. So you need to be more grateful for where you are now. Like, think about the things that you have right now. Be grateful for those things. And if it's like anything that somebody has done to hurt you or make you feel some kind of way, you need to... Forgive them and let it go. Though it's it's, it's better is better said than done. Um, it's better said than done. But if you don't take action, then who will? Aries. Anything else? Aries needs another spirit. Okay, hold up. Let's see. Hang him in. Yeah. If any, if you don't do it, then who else gonna do it? You gotta be brave through this situation, these circumstances, because um, Yeah, you got to be brave through this.
Mm-hmm. Let's see. Anything else for it? Anything else for it? Any business? Okay. Bottom on the floor. Clean the cups. Now you need to pour into yourself, nurture yourself, love yourself. Um so that you can realize like, hey, I'm being lazy or I'm not doing enough in order to move myself forward. You gotta be truthful with yourself. Live in your truth. Are you doing everything you possibly can in order to um in order to look at the bigger picture? You got the hangman, you got the chariot, you got the knight of swords, eight of cups, the empress. It's like you're very like moody. You're in your emotions. You're feeling insecure. Um, you're not being able to do like you're not being able to like get out of your head and get out of your emotions so that you can succeed. The longer you're in your head the longer it's going to take you to get to um, a happy place. The longer it's going to take you to um, grow. Share it and move forward. Let's see. You got to be brave and fearless. You got to. You got to be brave. Especially if. You trying to be like. In the public's eye. Or like. On social media. Or like. Yeah, you can't be fearful or you're going to be defeated every time. Anything else Aries need to know, Spirit? Anything else Aries need to know? Anything else Aries need to know? So, yeah, it's like you're refusing to let things go. You're refusing to let people and places go that are not serving you. You're is and maybe it's not even that you're refusing to let go. It could be they're refusing to let you go too. Yeah. But it's like you spent a lot of time and energy into maybe these people, places or things. And It's hard to let go. It's, it is hard to let go. I mean, especially if it's people that you truly care about, such as family or like a husband or a wife or a really close friend that you've been friends with for a really long time. But it's time to let things go. It's time to let negativity go no matter what the negativity is like no matter what it is you gotta let it go because it's affecting you mentally emotionally and spiritually it's making you feel insecure it's making you lack confidence it's making you get in your head you sac sacrificing yourself in order to make other people happy when you're supposed to be making yourself happy Doing the things that you want to do. Taking action on the things that you want to succeed in. But yet, it's like... You're allowing... Your lack of confidence. Your lack of... Um,
your fear get in the way of doing these things. You're not going to be lonely because if I mean, you might be lonely for a little bit, but you got to be lonely for a little bit in order to in order to like figure things out for yourself. You got to be alone a little bit. What you scared of? What you afraid of? You you afraid to leave people behind? Are you afraid to like that you're gonna be by yourself alone for the rest of your life or something? You won't. You won't. Let's see. Anything else? Every evening, snow spirit. Let's see. Yep. If you don't let it go. Then you gonna continue to, um, you gonna continue to go through it. Yeah, you gonna continue to go through it until you take action. The only person who can take action and let it go is you. The only person who can take action and let it go is you. Yeah, yeah. Anything else every use needs to know spirit. So it's like you're emotional at this time. You've been emotional. You've been in your emotions. Feeling how you feeling. But it's like you ain't doing nothing about it. You gonna sit there and stay you gonna sit there and stay in it. Mm-hmm. You see anything else every use needs to know? Spirit. Yep, it's it, your journey is on the halt. Your journey is on the halt. Let's see. Away from yeah. So you gotta get away from. All the things that you are used to. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Yep. Yep. Energy giants. You got some energy drain. The negativity is draining you. Negativity is draining you. It's causing you to become weak and lose interest in things. Um, it's making you feel like you can't be yourself. You can't work for um, Changing yourself. Anything else Aries needs to know spirit. So it's like you gotta have the strength to be able to let go. You gotta be strong through this uh Aries. You gotta be able to let things go. Learn how to let things go, especially if they're not serving you or your higher good. Because if you don't, it's like You're not looking at the bigger picture because it's like you're not helping yourself and then you're not helping the people around you that are either either one taking advantage of you or um trying to make you feel like you have to stay in that stay in a situation or because you love these people you love these people like you have to stay in it you don't just because you love people don't mean you have to deal with their negativity just because you love people don't have to you don't have to deal with all of their drama that they come with all of their baggage that they come with you can let it go and let them deal with their own stuff especially if it's starting to affect you yourself 
and what you got going on in your life. Let it all go. Because if you don't, then one, they're not going to learn for themselves. And then two, you're just going to continue to stay in a um, insecure, lack of confidence, not taking action, not doing anything. And you're going to wonder why. But it's like, it's you. You got to let go. You got to have the strength to let go. You got to have the strength. To keep it pushing. To take action. You got to have the strength. Like even if you don't feel like it. Like even if one day you wake up. And you're supposed to go through. Hey, you supposed to go grocery shopping. You're supposed to go to work. You're supposed to go. Or get something for your kids. You're supposed to go get your hair done. Nails done. Something. Whatever, whatever it may be. And you don't feel like it. You make yourself do it. You make yourself do it. You go do it. Whatever it is. Like, you push yourself. Yep. Alright, I'm going to end this reading here. If you guys resonated with this reading, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Thank you, spirit. You wish it, you want special till I made you so You better act like you know